Hello. Hello, my name is Logan. Um, sorry for the lack of videos lately. Uh, I've been busy, and of course Nathan's laptop is down. That's why I'm commentating his gameplay here. Um, yeah, gameplay, Call of Duty. Yeah, that is that's the uh, the G something. Fuck, I should know this. Anyway, it's a burst fire. It's um, two hits, I think. One hit if all three bull bullets connect. Yeah, it's it's a pretty greasy gun. I'm not I'm not gonna lie. Not a lot of people use it surprisingly, but you do get that one guy with the scope that sits in the back of the map, just snipes everyone with it. And I don't know why Nathan was using it. It is a really really good gun. What is he waiting for? Like his teammates are already out there. It's not really a close quarters. He's, is he using, um... In the air. Yeah, he's using steady aim. I never use steady aim. He's being cautious for some strange reason. Ah, oh, second chance. I I use second chance. I can't say anything. It's, it's really greasy. And if anything, if, in hardcore, like, say, M14 takes, uh, one shot to kill people in hardcore. If you have second chance, it takes two shots. Then you have to kill the person that when they're in second chance. So it's basically juggernaut. I don't know if anyone else noticed that, or is it just me? Because I know if you have, se why didn't you see that guy? Oh, that nice, nice spray. That was that was pure luck. Before I, another thing I don't understand: why you fucking reload the barrel? Hey, make a look at that. You're reloading the barrel. It makes no sense. That, that was a good throw. Too bad if- Oh, that was Grease McGee. That was just pure luck right there. Man, this is a pretty greasy commentary. Um, yeah, you reload the fucking barrel. Anyway, hardcore, you actually get more health if you use second chance. I don't know if anyone else notices that, or if it's just me. Yeah, see, this gun's actually pretty beast if you stay at a medium or long range. Ready for it's uh, not really good for close quarters because I guess you could spray, but you can't spray effectively. So he's got the black bird up, I think. You see, you reload the barrel, it makes no sense. Nathan's going around the map, he's owning people with his gun. That guy didn't even- oh, there he goes, finally someone came up behind me. Did he die before that? I don't remember. Oh, here comes the chopper gunner, oh god. Personally, I never had a chopper gunner. It must feel nice. I, I never turn it on because I usually never get that high on a kill streak. Actually, I never get that high on a kill streak. <laughs> My kill streak is um, a two, and uh, I call him my. <laughs> I call him my. Oh, I can't even think straight today. I call him the UAV, the UAV, because you know, I, I only said that because fucking Call of Duty calls helicopters Hilo, but like Huey. That's what it is, a Huey. Instead of Hilo, it's Huey. So I'm calling it UAV UAV. Because Call of Duty is stupid, stupid game, and mispronounces things for no apparent reason. And yeah, he's he's raping them. I'm not quite sure if he raped them as much as that last time, but it was still a good little rape. Got shit ton of kill. What? So he gets up, and this guy is already there. Oh, that was. I he kind of panicked there. You could see that his aim was kind of off. But uh, me, I would have uh, ran away with my. Gun between my legs. Python is a good handgun, I have to admit. I had some fun times with that. Python, buddy, got rid of it for the MP5. Also, a good gun, not gonna lie. Our spy in the yeah, I have him. Okay, he missed the guy. He missed the guy. Is he. 
Okay, so, okay, that is just pure luck. Nathan is the luckiest son of a bitch. Whenever I play Call of Duty, it's like, <gasps> there's two guys. <gasps> I'm dead. I never, like, it doesn't work on me. It's 38 and 2, Jesus Christ. Well, well, that was pretty good. Thanks for watching. Hopefully Nathan gets his computer soon, so you have to stop listening to my rambling of bullshit. I think I'm using the FAMAS. It's not as powerful. It's a good gun.